what's going on guys? It's Mark from Limo Marketer back with another video for you all. In today's video, I wanna go over the numbers. Pay-per-click versus search engine optimization. Which one should you be doing? Should you be doing both? And really the, the, the simple answer to that is it depends. So it depends on where you're at in your business. And uh, if you, if possible, if your business has the extra funds, I always recommend doing both. Um, but if you're just starting out, if you don't have a lot of cash flow, uh, I'm going to show you why SEO might not be the first thing you start with your business. Now, so I've drawn a chart, this chart here, and you're going to notice on the, uh, I believe it's called the Y axis, we have your cost per lead on the X axis, time and months. Okay, so we've got a full year here. Okay, now this chart I'm basing off of a few different things. One, I'm basing it off of you having a, a new website, okay? A website that maybe you just registered the domain. Maybe you've had it for a few years, but you haven't built any links to it and you haven't done any SEO on it. What you'll find is, and, and this is based on being in a somewhat competitive market, maybe a tier two market, um, as opposed to like LA, New York, which might even take longer. So. These lines here, this black line is pay-per-click, the blue line is SEO, search engine optimization, okay? And this is how much you're paying per lead. And you're gonna notice right away, uh, pay-per-click starts out at a pretty low cost per lead. Now, um, I'm basing, these are kind of, uh, these aren't going to be exact numbers, they're just here to kind of make a point of how you can compare them and their relative cost per leads. So with a pay-per-click campaign, you can see right away, your cost per lead starts out pretty low. Uh, this is, of course, assuming you're working with an agency uh, that knows what they're doing. Uh, you can see this business here, they're starting out with a cost per lead of probably around uh, 40 or so dollars, uh, might even be a little bit less than that. And then over the course of months, this is actually supposed to get smaller and smaller. I know here it looks like the, the cost went up, but Essentially with pay-per-click within, um, if you're working with a really good agency that knows your industry, within a few weeks, you're gonna be getting really good results. You'll get your cost per lead uh, in the limo industry, like down to $10, $12, $8. That's a good cost per lead in a market that isn't like LA, San Francisco, New York. But it does, it is gonna probably start a little bit higher. It might start at $30, $40 a lead. If you're working with an agency that doesn't have experience in your industry, it could take a few months to get that cost per lead down to under $10. SEO is much different in that, so you start paying an SEO agency um, to, to build links to your site, uh, to do the on-site optimization. And let's just say you're in a market like Oh, San Diego, okay, so you're paying this SEO agency $1,500 a month, right? And so in those first three months, you might not even get any leads because, you know, they're doing the on-site optimization, they're building links to your site, your site hasn't gotten any traction, it's not on the first page, and, and there's not many people that go to the third page. Uh, so your cost per lead is going to be really high, it's actually more than $1,500, it's, it's pretty much, it's, uh, what, what's that sign for infinite? It's pretty much infinity because you're not getting any leads. So you're just spending money, but you're investing that money, right? Because um, SEO eventually, when your site's ranked up top, you're still paying the same amount of money to that SEO agency, but getting a lot of leads. And so what you'll see here is, and this is at the three month mark, it could be at the two month mark, it could be at the four or five month mark, you start gaining some traction, you start getting some leads. Because remember, we're paying 1500 a month in this example for SEO okay and so at, at this point here maybe we're you know at the six month mark we're getting a few leads a month and then as we get onto that first page our cost per lead is going to go lower and lower right because these first three months we, we didn't even get any leads let's say we get one one or two in months you know three through six or three through seven and then by month, you know, seven, eight, nine, we're getting more and more leads. And so really where SEO really starts being worth it is um, in competitive markets with a new website is after that one year mark. 
And so a lot of you are probably like a, a year, I, I don't have a year to wait. Well, think about it this way. If you had to look into the future five years from now, wouldn't you had kind of hope that you would have started this? I mean, if you could go to your past self five years ago and say, hey, start investing in SEO now, it probably would have been the best decision you ever made. As long as you find a vendor, that's good. Uh, I drew this little chart up here because I wanted to capture uh, where we're at at the two year mark. So let's, let's pretend this line is $10 a lead, this is 20, and this is, you know, this is the end of year two. So end of year two, okay? And so our, our pay-per-click, we're still, the price is still about the same, right? Because at a certain point with pay-per-click, you're not gonna keep improving and dropping the cost per lead significantly. Google wants uh, their, pound, their pound of flesh, so to speak. But so with SEO though, so maybe at the one year mark, we're paying around 20 a lead. And then over time, let's say maybe the, it could be at the one year mark, it might be at the year and a half mark. Eventually, there's going to be this point right here. And that is when SEO becomes a lower cost per lead than pay-per-click. And so this is when your site becomes very valuable. Now, uh, say you're spending that 1500 a month, this is when you're getting about 150 leads a month, right? Let's do leads per month. And then, you know, if we did year three here, 10, 20, end of year three, this line would still, you know, we're still at maybe around 10, eight, nine, 10 bucks a lead with pay-per-click, but now our cost per lead with SEO is even less. We might be at, let's say 225 leads per month. And really, SEO is a long-term play and it's probably the best investment you can make in your business. I'm asked a lot of times why I don't talk about SEO more. Well, one thing, uh, we, we currently don't offer search engine optimization, but another thing is a lot, most business owners don't have the patience to wait two or three years for results. They can't afford to wait that long. But if you found a good SEO agency, it really will be the best investment you ever make because your website is an asset and unlike your vehicles, this asset will appreciate if you're doing SEO, if you're building links to your site and increasing the, the lead flow on your website. Because a site that gets, you know, 10, 15 leads a day, think about if you have to pay $10 a lead with Google Ads and your website is generating 10, 15 leads a day, really, that could be worth $100 to $150 a day. Over the course of a month, that could be worth $3,000 to $4,500 a month because those would be leads you would have to pay um, Google or Bing for. What I want you to take from this video is this. I recommend both pay-per-click and SEO. If your business is at the point where you don't have a lot of extra cash flow to invest, you know, maybe you just started or, or maybe uh, it's been slow and you just don't have the extra cash flow. Well, then I would recommend doing pay-per-click because uh, pay-per-click can help you build up that cash flow so you can end up reinvesting in search engine optimization. But if you have the extra thousand, fifteen hundred, two thousand, could be as much as twenty five hundred to three thousand a month. If you're in a market like New York, Los Angeles, San Francisco, uh, those are very competitive markets. Uh, to find a really good SEO agency, it could cost that much. But long term, it is always worth it. That's really all this video was about, guys. Um, just remember this, with pay-per-click, your cost per lead, uh, once you get to that fourth, fifth, sixth month mark, uh, it's not going to uh, be reduced much drastically, unless you're working with an agency that doesn't know what they're doing, uh, because 
I have taken and built campaigns that were at a $20 cost per lead for a year and immediately overnight dropped them to $10 per lead. But the campaigns we build, uh, they usually start out at around $20, $25 a lead and within a week or two, we have them down to eight, 10, $12 a lead, sometimes as little as five or $6, depending on the market. As soon as you do have that free cash flow, I would start reinvesting in your website because again, your website will appreciate vehicles that you purchase, all they do is depreciate. And so we really want to think long-term here. Think like Jeff Bezos, right? Uh, think where you want to be five years from now. And uh, if you have to make some sacrifices now in your business, you will be thanking yourself in several years when your cost per lead, your overall cost per lead is lower. Because if we combine, if you're doing 225 leads per month from this, and let's say 150 from Google Ads, and you're paying $10 a lead for Google Ads, that's $1,500 a month. Uh, but those 225 leads you're still paying $1,500 a month for. Uh, what would that be? That would be about six or seven dollars a lead, right? So you'd be paying $3,000 a month, but you'd be getting 375 leads a month. So overall, it would bring down your average cost per lead. And that's really what we wanna do in the long term. We wanna get as many leads as we can, quality leads for as little money as we can because that's going to lower our cost per client acquisition. And in turn, that is going to increase our net profit. So anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you want me to look over your Google or Bing ads campaign, I would love to do that. Just leave a comment below and we'll audit your campaign. Or if you're not running a campaign, we can show you what you can expect as far as how many leads you would get, what your costs would be, per lead would be and what sort of revenue you can expect the campaign to generate in that first month to three months down the road. So anyways, guys, if you like this video, please give it a like, please comment below. Let me know how you like the video, if you got some value from it, and I'll see you guys next time.